Hola. How are you all doing today? How did you ways? This is uh, James and Edgar here again, your faithful hosts. We'll never cheat on you, maybe. I have a confession. <laughs> <laughs> I've been seeing other hosts. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see, we're playing the Sly Collection today, and by that I mean we're probably we're gonna play the first Sly Cooper game. Yay. Uh what is over here? Credits, great. Alright, so Sly yeah, Cooper. Yeah, now we're gonna play the credits. Yeah! <laughs> Beat the game. Uh let's start it. This is the first one? This is the first one. Oh, Devious okay. Raccoonus. Quite a name. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> When the say what loads up, I fucking love Sly Cooper. My phone just vibrated <laughs> very loudly. Can you feel the love? Ooh. I never saw that movie. Which one? Sucker Punch. Oh, <laughs> completely different thing. Uh, Zack Snyder film. It's 420! It's 420! <laughs> I like it. I like that movie actually more than most. A lot of people hate it. I understand. Yeah, that's what I heard. I get it. But I like that movie actually. Beautiful looking movie. Oh god, childhood. <laughs> I played the fuck out of Sly Cooper when I was a kid. Oh my god, I was like, it was like to what Jack and Daxter was to you was Sly Cooper to me. Oh yeah. Yeah. It was like from a from that weird era where the PS2 was trying to like get so many different mascots. Oh yeah, like Ratchet and Clay, yeah. Jack and Daxter, Sly Cooper, Sly Cooper, and then they brought over uh, Crash Bandicoot. They were all oh, still yeah. trying to yeah, you know yeah. get that weird furry. Mascot deal. He's a wombat. Yeah. <laughs> so, Sly Cooper was my favorite. That's the one that I loved. I played the first Jack and Dax. I played all the Jack and Dax, but I loved the first one. This is almost kind of like the same idea comparing it to the sequels where in 2 and 3 you had health bars and everything. Mm -hmm. and it was sounding kind of darker. Mm -hmm. First games are a little bit more kiddie. Yeah, yeah, especially. And you only get like one hit healths. What, wasn't that in the first game? You didn't have a health bar. You had like nothing. I think it was two hits. Yeah, two hits. Pretty much how that is in this game. You, uh, like, the max you can get is three hits, and that's when you pick up these, like, lucky horseshoes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, uh, let's start the game. Sly! Come in! Sly! Do you read me? Do a barrel roll! <laughs> I was thinking of Solid Snake, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Fox. <laughs> Get over it, Bentley. You're safe in the van. You fucking cunt. Get I'm over it. <laughs> I've got to steal that file from Inspector Carmelita Fox. Les police. <laughs> Les police. <laughs> got their security system totally scoped. To get inside, you're gonna have to go through that air vent. All right. I'm going. <laughs> that air vent. <laughs> over there. <laughs> All you gotta do is grab the file and get back to the van. We'll do the rest. Just keep that engine running, Murray. I'll be down in no time. God, I love these guys. <laughs> I love the whole team. Oh, this is such great memories. Now then, beat the fuck out of everything, get all the coins. That's what I always do in, like, uh, Ratchet and Clank games. You just beat the fuck out of everything <laughs> it's around. It's like, oh, dude, it was funny, because uh, my favorite uh, Ratchet and Clank is uh, Deadlocked. Uh, did I ever play Deadlocked? Isn't that the if one? If you have it, I will bring it, because it is... My all-time favorite. I maxed out the co the bolts. Which one is Deadlock? Oh, is that the Ratchet the one solo? Where, yeah, where he gets the armor I and it's only him. Lock. Yeah, dude, the <laughs> max amount of bolts you can get is ninety nine million nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. So this reminds me of the thing in Thunderball. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! But I maxed it out on two save files. Jeez, you were I, fucking I freezing. binged on that shit, wow. dude. Oh, yeah. I maxed out almost all weapons. Uh-huh. And... Fuck except it. for the melee weapons. I, I hardly use melee weapons. Uh-huh. But, uh... Dude, uh, it's so great. <laughs> I breeze through the bosses like nothing now. It's like, I take out my sniper rifle, two hits, third uh -huh. health is like three quarters down. <laughs> <laughs> it's one way to explain it. You're breaking the fourth wall, guys. <laughs> Jesus. You're breaking the fourth wall, guys. 
I actually think with the Metal Gear Solid connection, they do, yeah, they do the same thing in Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> like, press the circle button to do this. <laughs> All right, the circle button. Friggin... Oh, fuck, what was it? Um... Fuck, I can't remember the, li the life... Oh, Jesus. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, when you knock out those, it takes out all the sensors. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice job, you're in. Inspector Carmelita Fox's office is behind the red door. That's one of the few bosses later on. Less wanted. Yeah, it's, uh, I believe that's the panda. Or I could be fucking wrong, but I think it is him. Oh, the, those optics remind me of the snipers from Ratchet and Clank. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I know where we're supposed to go, but I just want to have a look around. There ain't shit. Okay. <laughs> Go here. <laughs> <laughs> it's locked. Oh. <laughs> super reinforced. It's just one lock. <laughs> <laughs> now then. It's like one of those chain locks. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's super reinforced. So, just so they don't know I'm here, so we can be super sneaky. Oh my god. They'll never know I was here. I see books. Oh, it is so, is so there... many memories. Way to go, oh, yeah, This yeah. is where Inspector Carmelita Fox stashes all her important files. I hacked into the police security mainframe and discovered this vault's combo. Try dialing in 937. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> In each episode area, there's a vault to collect, but uh -huh. you have to get, like, literally, like, all of the, uh, bottles lying around. Uh -huh. They're, like, clue bottles. Oh, God. In the first, in this game, it's ridiculous, because there's, like, 30 each little mission, mm -hmm. instead of, like, world. Because usually there's, like, 30 bottles in the whole world in the sequels, and this one's, like, 30 bottles each mission. Oh, okay. So, it gets ridiculous. Anyway, uh, but, it, but it's very helpful, because it gives you really cool moves to do it all. Oh, that's and So we will try to do it, because I have... I remember a lot of this game, thankfully. Hmm. You foolish raccoon. We will bre we will breeze through this way better than I could breeze through Mirror's Edge. So. Okay. <laughs> Which reminds me, you need to return the Firestone of India to its rightful. The Firestone of India. I was gonna give it to you as a little token of my. Hey, you know that bazooka really brings out the color of your eyes. Very fetching. You think? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the paralyzing punch. You are Paralyzing crazy. punch. Might snap you out of your crime spree. And give up our little rendezvous. Plenty of time for that once you're safely behind bars. Love to stick around and chat, but I just dropped by to pick up this case file. I think you've had it long enough. He sounds way more like airy in his voice airy? than he does in any of the scene. Like, oh, you're very. Yeah, it brings out the color in your eyes. Oh, that way, that's what you mean. Yeah. Like, he sounds way more toned down in the sequels. Oh, no coins. Ah! I died. <laughs> so what was I saying earlier? <laughs> I always die in this part. I've always tried to fucking get through it, but I always die in that little part. Oh, you fucks! <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. It's funny because it literally, like, everything's already gone. Uh -huh. So it's just me going through this shit. And the, the uh, thing's already open, too. Oh, okay. So I don't have to redo that. Well, that's good. Well, this is still here, though. It's just some bullshit. Fuck it. Oh, Jesus. Ah! Coin. <laughs> <laughs> so I just need to go around again. So yeah, if we weren't fucking around earlier, you could see how quickly I can get through this mission. Okay. <laughs> but fucking around's right there. Give me the coins. Pretty much. <laughs> You'll never catch me. She kind of did a few seconds ago. Oh, oh. Jesus. Yeah, for some oh, reason, when you jump on the cars, you're very slow. Oh, help hey, me! Man. You can't escape me, raccoon! She just stands there. <laughs> <"Nyah!"> Come on, man. <laughs> it's... <laughs> Turn it up a little for us. Finally, the secret police file I've been searching for all these years. With this, 
I can avenge my family and regain possession of our most valued treasure. Let's look at Sly Cooper in this game and then look at him in the fourth game where he's super detailed and even creepier. I come from a long line of master thieves who kept all their secrets of sneaking and stealing in an ancient book. The Phoebeus Raccoon. Yeah. Anyone who read it learned to be especially sneaky, which is why we specialize in stealing from criminals. After all, there's no honor, no challenge, no fun stealing from ordinary people. You rip off a master criminal, and you know you're a master thief. <coughs> well, on the night I was supposed to inherit the book, five visitors came unannounced at the door. My father fought to protect us, but the gang of villains known as the Fiendish Five overpowered him and ransacked our house until they found the Phoebeus Raccoonus. Our family's manual of thieving greatness fell into their filthy hands. They tore the their filthy Jew-like hands. Whoa, Sly! <laughs> well, shit. Yeah. Broken alone, I was dumped at the town orphanage. There I met two guys who became my lifelong buddies and trusted crew. Bentley, techno genius and strategist supreme. And Murray, part-time driver and full-time burden. Together we pledged to track down the fiendish five, avenge my father, and steal back the thievious raccoons. I knew I was about to face the toughest test of my life. On this mission, I would either become a master thief like my ancestors before me, or fail and allow my family name to bite the dust. Well, yeah, quite no pressure. Setup. Yeah, no pressure. <laughs> <laughs> quite the setup. God, I'm all smiles playing this game. I fucking love this game. Yeah, it's... That was a nice piece of work back there at police headquarters, Sly. Come see me if you want we to have check 0%. out any of your old movies. I've got them all here on my computer. Use the left analog stick to move around. <laughs> Uh, hey, this is a kid's game. They had to describe things to you. I've already plotted a route to our first target. So, he's there. You can say hi to Murray. Hi, Murray. <laughs> you want one? <laughs> I don't even know what he's eating. It looks like peanuts. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's not even taking out the nuts. He's well, just eating the shells. People do that sometimes. Really? Or animals oh. do that. I've <laughs> There's a big difference between oh, people I don't, and him. I don't fucking know. So you can go over to Bentley just to see the cutscenes. Oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah. 